charity that began in 1980 has surpassed $1 million in donations. News Channel 10's Kelsey Davis was in Hereford and explains how the Christmas Stocking Fund continues to help residents in need. There's so many things in Hereford that people give back to. Um, it really is just such a generous community, and that has been a, a, a blessing to grow up in, a blessing to come back and work in. The Christmas Stocking Fund helps with food, vouchers, clothing, utilities, and bills. You know, I think it's an opportunity for the residents that maybe wouldn't come out and ask for help from somebody. They get to do so a little bit more anonymously and still receive the aid that they need. I don't think it's that you turn a blind eye, but maybe you just don't know that people are struggling that much in your own backyard. Def Smith Electric Cooperative directly helps with distributing food boxes to residents in need. Probably the most important part of delivering the boxes to the residents is just to see them be so appreciative of the help. You know, people are proud and it's not easy to ask for help. The Hereford Holiday Initiative figures to make its mark for many more years to come. You know, this year we hit the million dollar mark, uh, 44 years in the making. We have really accelerated the giving over the past few years, and so I think that $2 million mark will come quite a bit sooner. The Christmas Stocking Fund is still taking donations through December 31st. Those can be made at First Bank Southwest here in Hereford. In Hereford, Kelsey Davis, News Channel 10.